Yeah, it's actually up a little bit from yesterday, like 10 CFS. Rain or shine, and fish or no fish, you're gonna be out there. You kind of question your sanity. You're wondering, wow, I could be home having a cup of hot chocolate reading a book, but instead I'm out here in waist deep, 38 degree water, <laughs> fishing for this fish of a thousand casts that I probably won't get for the next week or two. <laughs> I grew up really learning a respect for the river. A healthy river system uh, is, is extremely important, obviously, especially here on, on the Trinity. It's, to me, it's a special place that it, I've been able to pass on to Leslie now, that special place. It's a legacy thing. I think we need to take care of those so other people can, can pass that on to their children. The Trinity is one of those special rivers where you can have, you know, double digit fish days. And it's not all the time, but it's kind of unique, I feel like, in that way where some people come steelheading their first time and, you know, I give them the talk, you know, sometimes it's a little bit hard, but you should keep at it and persevere and then they'll, we'll go out and we'll catch six, seven fish, you know, in one day, so. That is true. It is, it is I feel, unique in that kind of perspective compared to other rivers in this kind of Northern California area that I've fished. Guides could either be, have a positive impact or a negative impact. If you're a guide and you're just thinking about the next day making your buck, you know, taking people down the river and you're not passionate about it, it's just kind of a job for you, then you don't really care about the resource. You're not going to kind of emphasize that to your clients. So I think as guides, A, it's important to be passionate about what you do for a living and B, you know, you can't just you look at it as a source of income. You have to like think longer and bigger terms. Being able to, to see Leslie on this river where I basically started my steelheading career is uh, Im impressive, very impressive. I mean, and I'd like to see that happen for, for her children, you know, in the future and, and their children beyond that. So uh, protection is incredibly important. Rivers provide a really good quality of life.